my whole life I've been running, whether it be from someone or something, I've been running. When I was younger, the first thing I can remember was that I told myself I'd never give up or run away from the things I love the most. Years later, I'm now 20 years old, which is crazy to even hear me say, 20 years old. And the only thing I've done is run. I ran away from my friends, my family, but most importantly, I ran away from the promise I made to myself as a little kid. I ran away from doing what made me happy, or what made me the happiest. As a kid, I was always fascinated by a camera. Something about being able to capture a moment in time and truly being able to be yourself knowing that no one on the end of the camera could take that away from you, it just felt amazing. I trusted everything I had in me to making videos, hoping one day I could help or make one person, even if it was just one person, smile. I felt invincible. I felt invincible. That feeling slowly faded away when I began to get teased for doing it. At first I thought what I was doing was working because people were smiling and laughing whether I posted something new. The only thing was that they weren't laughing or smiling with me. They were laughing at me. From that point forward, the passion I had that, that what made me feel invincible made me feel out of place. I still continued to make videos because it made me feel important. Even if people were laughing at me, they were still noticing me for who I was, whether it was making fun of me or clowning on me, they were still noticing me and taking the time to go and look into what I was doing. That changed when I started getting older. I started getting a different mindset. I started getting into relationships and put more effort into that than I was with my videos and it became a monthly thing rather than a daily thing. I eventually really took time away from videos when I learned uh, what the classic tale of heartbreak was like. It pushed me down into a dark place. A dark place where I was just known as the YouTuber kid from high school who got his heart broken by some girl. I let that define who I was. I let the things people said define who I was. I let myself become all the things I never wanted to be. I pushed away my friends, my family, to the point where there is no relationship anymore. I let it break me. I let it make me think the thing that made me invincible was a burden rather than a gift. I learned what it was like to lose everything I loved. I learned what it was like to lose me. But eventually that changed when I met her. She walked into my life when I was broken and she fixed me without realizing it. She accepted my passion as a pro and not a con. She showed me how to love me and how to feel okay even when I wasn't. She believed in me and I couldn't describe how much it means to me because she helps me see what I can't see in me. She showed me that it's okay to be who I am and accepted me for who I truly was. So I'll admit it, she's the reason I got through. I knew it was love when I knew I'd feel lost if I ever lost you. I may regret what I say but never how I feel. So I'm done running. I used to be scared of who I'd be if I was happy. I was scared of failure so I stopped trying. I'm done being scared and I'm done running. Instead I'm running towards my problems and I'm going to beat them all because I know I can as long as I Stay positive. That was way too cheesy.